torch carrier. We're here to tell you about the Olympic torch relay and the torch bearers who carry the Olympic flame. So what do they have to do exactly? Well, they run for a kilometre or more, passing the torch off from hand to hand like in a really long relay race. They need to be very careful not to extinguish the flame and make sure they never stop running, no matter what the weather's like. Simple, huh? Well, today, my champion, you two will have the honour of carrying the Olympic spirit for a whole kilometre. So let's give the folks at home a recap. To fill the pig's heart with the Olympic spirit, we'll make him put on a pair of tiny lightweight running shorts and have him wait for the torch at the start of his kilometre, which is a snow-covered uphill course, naturally, and they forecast storms, hail and blizzards. He'll be a hero! I've got to find something a little more convincing. A super crazy cat idea! All we need to do is to tell the pig what carrying the Olympic torch really means. It means having adoring fans on every street, in every square. I mean, sure, it'll be a kilometre long run, and not an easy one maybe. But everybody will be there to watch him, cheer him on, and shower him with delicious acorns. There, I've convinced him. He's taken up the torch. Look at how he's running. Not noticing the cold, heedless of the lightning, oblivious to the snow that's covering him. Yes, he's finished the whole kilometre. I'm proud of my pig and the Olympic spirit. Well then, my fine young pig, you were incredible. So incredible that I've signed you up for another 10 kilometres. That way you can train some more. 